And that's why it's just such like a paradox of being a leader is there's this mentality of being selfless, of being a servant and giving and providing um, as a mode of leadership, which is a, an amazing trait for leaders, but it has to be done from a place of having your cup full enough to do that. And I think that's one of the things that I notice so many people struggle with is we're, that's our default mode where we just, we give and give and give, but then we get burnt out. And then we go through these cycles where it's just like this roller coaster where you give and give and give, and then you burn out and you flatline and then you kind of crawl your way out of it. And then it just kind of keeps happening because it's this cycle that you haven't been able to break. Um, So true. And looking back, like, retrospectively to my time in college pro or my time in a sports wanting to be like a captain and things like that. Like I'd look back and go, I just, I wasn't being a leader because I wasn't showing up for myself or I wasn't setting ex- like high examples for, you know, a, a fitness routine or things like that. Like I wasn't leading by example in all those times. And with college pro, even I was so consumed with like making sure like my culture was good and my painters were making money and all stuff. And I made probably half of what all my painters made that summer. Like I didn't care enough about myself first in so many instances. Um, so it's really, it, I'm feeling it so much more in, in the culture I'm building with my company. It's way more authentic to like me because I'm showing them that I'm showing up for myself first and I'm putting up boundaries and I'm sticking to time off when I say I'm going to take time off. Like there's, there's a huge shift that's happening. 